Okay, so you're trying to get into Blender, but you just can't get past your fear for it. The interface is intimidating, 3D is an entire world of its own. Everything is just pretty overwhelming. Yeah, the same thing happened to me too. I literally downloaded beginner tutorials for Blender for the first time, September 2017. And it took me till August 2021 before I actually managed to follow through and finish a Blender tutorial. This was that tutorial and this was the end result. And bro, once I finished that, I just kept on going. So I posted something recently and someone actually asked me a question and I was like, he's been struggling with consistency in Blender and I'll admit it's a very hard thing. But one thing I did know was that before I became a Blender artist, I was first of all a video editor and a VFX artist. So basically I would film stuff and edit it and that was how I was able to break into, you know, being more comfortable with Blender because I searched for and followed tutorials closely that would help me create cinematic shots like I would actually film stuff in real life. So, you know, being able to, so, you know, so, you know, convincing my brain that yes, this program is cool by learning stuff that enabled me to create 3D scenes, which I had full control of and I could, you know, make it look as cool as my skills or I, make it look as cool as I wanted to or my skills would let me to. It was just my, that was basically my entry point into Blender in a nutshell. Now, it took me about two to three months fiddling around in Blender before I was finally able to push myself to sit through and learn the 16-part donut tutorial basics. So, if you're actually someone that sees Blender as a really cool software, you see the really cool things that people are doing with this program and you just don't know how to break into it and it can be very overwhelming. One thing I'll say is try to find out things about yourself you like or try to find out things in real life that you find very amusing and look for tutorials that can teach you how to replicate those things from real life in Blender. You know, I saw some really cool KDA Korean 3D music videos and I learned and I looked for tutorials that I thought could help me try to recreate some things I saw there. And then I was able to just become more and more comfortable in Blender. It could be sculpting. You can just learn how to model a bottle or sculpt something. I don't know if you like drawing, sculpting could be your way into Blender. The thing that people get wrong is that you don't have to learn everything in a particular order. Just do the parts that you find fun and that way you trick your brain into wanting to see through the process of learning the more complex parts. So yeah, this video isn't going to be very edited. I just wanted to do something. I'm still experimenting with YouTube videos and I don't know what works here but I hope I was able to get through to someone today and convince them to try a different approach. And yeah, comment if you would want me to talk about something else. I'm still experimenting. It's just so sad and funny that for someone that can edit so well to an extent, I don't know how to figure out this YouTube thing. Thank you so much for watching. Once again, my name is Alam Mari. I'm a video editor, visual effects artist and 3D artist from Lagos, Nigeria. Subscribe, yeah.